So once again here at the Biohacker Summit 2022 in Amsterdam, and we have Sakari from Finland. Sakari, tell us what are you doing and what are you speaking about? Oh, thank you for, like, it's great to be here. Thank you for, for inviting us. So what we do here is we present our solution or novel way of uh, improving oral health to let people uh, and, and our customers and, and the biohackers to actually alter and come back the biofilms they have or the dental plaque so they can hack their oral health. Before they couldn't target the treatment at the plaque, but now we give the means that they can actually they can use supplements and get better in like uh, in their uh, digesting uh, and also in the oral bacteria hacking. But then they have uh, always had a problem that what about the biofilms they have on their teeth surface? What to do about those? And now they can also work with work with our method to get rid of the non-wanted bacteria. So what is the name of your method? It's Lumoral. Lumoral? Yes. So it's a total solution for dental health. It's not like a device or a specific thing, or how does it work? It's a device, and it's a, it's a, there is a Motrin's component, so it's a two-component system. What we want to achieve with that is the targeted effect, and it's also it's a Motrin's and the light activation. So it's a light therapy plus this sort of... Uh, catalyst which is uh, in form of a mouth rinse. Okay, so it's using light to clear the plaque. It's using the, the combination. Together it's using the light and then the substance and together they kind of give it a strong effect. Okay. So uh, neither of them works alone, but together they are more targeted and beneficial. Absolutely. And were you speaking here today at the summit? Yeah, I just had a had a small, uh, small uh, good lecture to interesting audience. Yes, and what is the main thing you're speaking out? Well, what do people need to know about their dental health? I think a lot of them don't understand that what is behind the dent- dental diseases? Why why they come? What is the how the dental plaque is building on top of the teeth and what does it mean especially in the systemic health aspect? So it's a, I think there's a lack of everybody understand that they can have cavities. They understand that they have a, like a, they have a block or tartar, but they don't really understand why and what is the what is the systemic health effect. So I wanted to give brief window to that that topic. What is the reason why? Like, if you could sum it up in a few sentences. It's it's it, it's not about just about teeth. It's about staying healthy and not having a like a chronic level of inflammation building up year after year after year, and then when you're old, you would have uh, problems because dental diseases, they are asymptomatic. You have maybe some gum bleeding here and there, but we want to say that you have to kind of, you have it, you would have to kind of do something about it. And in Chinese medicine, they look a lot at the mouth and the tongue and all of that. So I think what you're saying is really based on many thousands of years of I would say so, and uh, also in the Western medicine, we have had a, we had a problem that the, the, we had the dentist, and then we had the general medicine. But nowadays, I think these are also getting together more and more to understand that actually the mouth is uh, it's an in- infection port to the body, but it also represents the body health really well. For example, somebody has a diabetes. One of the key first symptoms they might have. It's a deteriorating gum health. They have a really quickly forming periodontal disease. Those two are really closely linked to each other. Very interesting. If people want to learn more about your uh, dental health system, where should they look? Go to our website, lumoral.com, or visit Go to Health, which is more about the component, uh, what is the antibacterial solution in, 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 uh, as a platform. But lumoral.com is the, where we have the most info about the product. Of course, they can check uh, our scientific articles, which are all published in this uh, lumoral.com portal. Are you targeting mostly like customers or practitioners or dentists? or? We work with uh, both. We are gathering more clinical data all the time and working together with the uh, dental practices also. But of course, like biohacking communities, meeting people with the willingness and desire to learn more about their own health and dental biofilms 
these events will be in our our calendar for sure for future also. Do you think this information is something that children need to know or be taught like from a young age or who does it concern mostly? For children, I think the most important is to keep it simple. So maybe not go too deep in the topic. But uh, of course, in, uh, in terms of cavity formation, prevention is the key. We started as soon as possible. For that also, we are actually working also for uh, children mouthpiece to have a cavity prevention system for children in the near future. So uh, a piece that you wear that protects your teeth from cavities? No, it's a, it's a same antibacterial solution device, smaller mouthpiece to fit, uh, fit, oh, to children, fit children's to fit children's mouth oh. better. What is the main reason for cavities from your perspective? It's a, it's a also related to bacteria biofilms. These sort of bacteria, they drive the local environment. So that when they attach and they make these biofilms or plaque, they make it so acidic so that no other bacteria can live there. And then what happens for, for example, for some children who have a re- uh, this sort of bacteria, they get cavities despite they have a normal oral hygiene. This is, I think, the one of our ideas is to targetly kill uh, these acidic plaques so that uh, the oral hygiene would be sufficient in preventing dental decay. So do you think it's mostly about oral hygiene, not so much about diet and other factors, or? I think they're all connected, because the diet and those other diet is of course stimulates how often you have these acid attacks, and also what is the inside of the diet uh, alters your saliva composition, and that will affect the buffering capability and as well as the remineralization rate of the the. the various process or cavity formation process. We can influence the, the root cause of the acid. And of course, the other areas should also be in, in uh, control. So are you recommending Candy Day Karki Paiva to kids in Finland? Or should yes. parents avoid that at all costs? Definitely Karki Paiva is a, is a good, good solution to at least not eat every day candy. Sure. All right. Thank you for being with us here at the summit. And yeah. We'll look up more about your work. Yeah, thank you. It was a pleasure.